Welcome to Technical Studies. In this video, we will learn about the most commonly used flanges in piping fabrication. The pipe flanges are the second most used joining method in the piping system after welding. They are used when need to dismantle the pipe spools easily. Here are the most commonly used flanges. Weld neck flange. Slip on flange. Socket weld flange. Threaded flange, lap joint flange, and the blind flange. Weld neck flange is the most widely used flange type in process piping. It gives the highest level of joint integrity as it is but welded with a pipe. These types of flanges are used in high pressure and temperature applications. Slip on flange has a hole that will match the outside diameter of the pipe through which the pipe can pass. The flange is placed on the pipe and is fillet welded from both inside and outside. Slip-on flange is suitable for low pressure and low temperature applications. Socket weld flanges have a female socket in which the pipe is fitted. Fillet weld is done only from outside on the pipe. Generally, it is used in small bore piping and is only suitable for low pressure and low temperature applications. A threaded flange has a thread inside the flange bore, which fits on the pipe with a matching male thread on the pipe. This type of joint connection is speedy and simple, but not suitable for high pressure and high temperature applications. The lap flange has two components, a stub end and a loose backing flange. The stub end is but welded to the pipe, and the backing flange moves freely over the pipe. The backing flange is usually made from carbon steel to save costs. The blind flange is a blank disc with bolt holes. These flanges are used with another type of flange to isolate the piping system or terminate the piping as an end. Thank you for watching.